Can you do energy work on your animal? Why am I doing it from this very unflattering angle? <laughs> I want you to see what they see. We've all met my little pupper. This is Maka. Maka's very old. He's a very, very old dog. I've had him for a very long time in New York. Now, uh, when it comes to energy work, thank you for being such a good model. One day, just recently, Maka was running around outside. He's too old to be running around, and he injured his hip. And we found him. He was lying down, and he was favoring that leg he wouldn't get up and his body was shaking and it was really kind of scary instead of taking him to the vet the very first thing that i want to do is to see if i can actually do anything and if a dog is sick you should take it to the vet but we wanted to see if we could do any kind of reparative work with his body before we jumped to the conclusion of needing to go to the vet so what we did is we had him sit down patiently and he wasn't moving he was shaking 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 and we did some energy work on this and for me when i do energy work because i can see what's going on inside of the body i just see if i can kind of plug it back in I was like kind of plugging some of his things back in, and then I take his his color, and I, not his not his sable color, but I take his color, his soul energetic color, and we just saturate everything. And from there, he did the funniest thing, didn't you, buddy? He stood up, shook it off, and ran away. He was like, "I'm good, I'm good." <laughs>